Well, when I was out at Jaws, November 26th, that I caught that big wave, uh, there was actually only a few guys, because everybody else left, everybody thought the swell had died and this and that. And it was my first wave, I didn't even catch a wave yet. We went over the back and I just looked and it literally looked like the whole ocean had stood up all at one time. And I was like, what's up? You know what I mean? As I was getting towed in, he was kind of going really fast and I was like kind of getting off balance. So I just let go of the rope so I wouldn't fall and blow it. I was thinking, oh no, I let go too early, too early. Next thing I know, I was like, oh. I seen, you know, I seen a line of hotel buildings, high, you know what I mean? It felt like I was looking at 30 foot, I mean, 30 story buildings, you know, like 20 of them long in front of me and like, oh my goodness, I, I gotta make this way, you know what I mean? I'm, uh, this, this is what's up. I remember going straight for a long time, like I, I came and I was thinking I shouldn't go too far to the bottom because I'll lose all my speed and I won't be able to make it to the end. So I dropped in, I kind of took a high line in the beginning and started dropping down. And when I started dropping back down, there were steps, like maybe four, six foot high that I was like falling off of. The wave was so big. I just remember, please lip, don't hit me in the back. I was just hoping that the wave didn't land on me. Rode it out, got to the end, kicked out and just like flopped over like a fish. <sighs> my legs were so sore. I don't know what it did. That one took some energy out of me. I don't know what it was. Oh my God, that was the biggest wave I ever seen. That was a monster, how that thing feels. It's like, I don't know, I'm just so happy. I just, I made that one. If I would've fell, I don't know, right? I don't know what would happen. And uh, that's basically what happened.